All right, our last batch is here. This is um, 12, so 15 will look like this. Let's just try to cover this entire piece. And I want to move it back. Uh oh. And I just want to, I just want this piece. So I just want to copy that and paste it. Move it out of the way a little bit. Oh, undo, undo. So I'm just going to go ahead and delete this line right here. Um, delete, delete, delete. Copy, paste, undo, undo, paste, mm. undo, paste, mm. Mm. undo, undo. Let me see if I can put it down here somewhere. Hmm. Well, it looks like I can't really do all this extra fancy stuff. So I'm just going to go ahead and bring three resistors up. 1K. One point five K. And one more resistor for a 2.2 K. So I'm just gonna pull all of these together. All right, there we go. So this is our last uh, resistor bank. This is 15 resistors. So let's pull up our meter. Start off at two. And at two, what do we have? Uh, I didn't bring up my meter. 654.206 microamps, so 654. 654.205 microamps. So that's gonna be E6. What else? What a six on the end. So this one is going to be equal to, and I probably shouldn't do that. Let me drop this down first. So this one is going to be equal to four. One point three. Eight one point three zero eight milliamps. Let's go six. One point nine six three milliamps.
Oh, that was six three. All right, so for eight, which we're not there yet, let's go ahead and double tap. Move this one over to eight. Say done. Uh, 2.617 milliamps. And then our last one is going to be 10. And that's just 3.271 milliamps. Three point one two seven milliamps. Double check, 3.271 milliamps. 3.127, am I thinking about that right? 271, okay. All right, there we go.